Today, I'm trying out a new recipe. Let's check it out. Welcome to another episode of Bite Size Seattle. Hi there, I'm Brett, marketing manager here at the Janus Group, your Seattle real estate team. The recipe that I'm making today comes from this excellent local cookbook, Naomi Tomke's The Pacific Northwest Seafood Cookbook. Black cod kasuzuke is a fish dish that is made with black cod, marinated in kasu, and then broiled. Kasu is the Japanese word for remnants. In English, kasu is most commonly referred to as sake lees. Sake lees are what is left over after making sake, the Japanese alcohol produced by fermenting rice. This particular recipe is originally from Shiro Kashiba, proprietor of Pike Place Market's Sushi Kashiba. Shiro Kashiba is considered by many to be the grandfather of sushi in Seattle, opening his first restaurant here in 1970. Before coming to Seattle, Shiro apprenticed in Tokyo under the great sushi master Jiro Ono, made world famous by the documentary Jiro Dreams of Sushi. A 1988 New York Times article credits Kashiba as the one who first put black cod kasuzuke on a menu in a Seattle restaurant. Today, kasuzuke is served at restaurants across Seattle, including at Sushi Kashiba. Okay, let's get started. It takes just three easy steps over three days to make this meal. Okay, here's what you'll need to make black cod kasuzuke. Day one. First things first, you'll need to procure your ingredients. If you are in Seattle, I recommend you go to an Asian grocery store like Uwajimaya. They will have everything that you need to make this. When you get the fish home, remove it from the packaging, rinse it off, pat it dry, and then salt it liberally on all sides. Then place it in your refrigerator for 24 hours. Day two, let's make the paste. Stir the sake lees miso, mirin, and sugar together to form a paste that is something resembling a pudding-like consistency. Remove the fish from the refrigerator and rinse it off, then pat it dry. Then cover the fish with the paste on all sides, returning it to the refrigerator for an additional 24 hours. Day three, preheat your oven to 450 degrees. Remove the marinated black cod from your refrigerator. Then, using a spatula or even your finger, remove the paste from the cod. Place the fish on a baking sheet and then put it on the top rack in your oven. Broil it for eight to 10 minutes. You'll know it's done when the fish has a nice black color to it and the meat flakes off easily with a fork. Serve immediately over warm rice with soy sauce on the side and enjoy. Thanks for watching this episode of Bite Size Seattle. Until next time, cheers. House goals realized. Janus Group at Remax Integrity. It's a tooth.